Welcome to the Heavy Spoilers Show. I'm your host, Paul, aka your friendly neighborhood spoiler man. And I never in a million years thought I'd be reading the headline that Jamie Foxx is returning as Electro in Spider-Man 3. Now, throughout this video, we're just going to be breaking down that shocking news as well as giving you the worst puns ever. If you're new to the channel, then make sure you subscribe for videos like this every day. And please drop a thumbs up if you're, if you're laughing as much as we are. Yes, I cannot believe this is real. Now, this has just been reported by The Hollywood Reporter in the last 30 minutes and, you know, they're, they're quite a legitimate source. Jamie Foxx, of course, played Electro in The Amazing Spider-Man 2, but when the franchise stalled and got cancelled by Sony, his chances of returning all kind of died out. However, it looks like they're bringing it all back together for the MCU, and you might remember that J. Jonah Jameson did feature at the end of Far From Home, so it looks like Marvel are really paying homage to these properties and even beginning to include them in their universe. Now, according to the article, John Watts, the filmmaker behind Homecoming and last year's Spider-Man Far From Home, is in the director's chair for the third installment, which Sony has dated for November 5th, 2021. Marvel have made no comment on the plot just yet, but it has been confirmed that Fox is returning in this stunning news. Is, is stunning even electricity pun? I'll stop with the crap puns anyway. Now, what this does is that it really opens the doorway to explore the multiverse in my opinion. J. Jonah Jameson was sort of a tease with this as he was of course a massive character in the Sam Raimi movies and the fact that Electro is being brought across from the Amazing Spider-Man franchise does hint at the direction that the studio is going. Now, I would love nothing more than to get a Tobey Maguire, Andrew Garfield and Tom Holland team up as they battle their villains across multiple dimensions and after the success of Into the Spider-Verse, I think it would just be absolutely amazing to see that sort of aesthetic in live action. With Jamie Foxx's return, I'm guessing that's not the big draw and there will be more to it as, as let's be honest, you know, he was fine in the movie, but he wasn't the knockout signing that you'd want to bring back for something like this. So I have to believe that there's more to the project, but at the moment, this is all that we really know. Now, if you're like me and you like to, to do all the memes that were in Amazing Spider-Man 2, you're, you're probably sitting, reading this article, listening to this video going, you lied to me, spoiler man. But I swear down, this is actually being reported right now. And it doesn't seem like anyone's denying it. it. It comes from a legitimate source such as The Hollywood Reporter. And yeah, if this is happening, you know what? Even though he wasn't my favorite villain, uh, as I'm sure you can guess, I'm still quite hyped. Now, obviously, I'd love to hear your thoughts on it, what your theories are about the film itself. And, and yeah, just let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, then please drop a thumbs up and make sure you check out our breakdown of the finale of Raised by Wolves, which is going to be linked at the end. Don't forget that we're also giving away a free copy of the Marvel Phase 1 box set and all you have to do to be in with a chance of winning is like the video, drop a comment below and make sure you subscribe with notifications on. The winner is going to be chosen at random on the 30th of October, so make sure you get involved. If you want to support the channel and get to see content early, then please consider clicking the join button below. You can also come chat us on the Discord server linked in the description or at Heavy Spoilers on Twitter. Thanks for making it until the end of the video. You've been the best. I've been Paul. I'll see you next time. Take care. Peace.